brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. The year may be coming to an end, but crime apparently never does. On December 23rd, Cindy Manabusin was leaving the Micronesia Mall with her daughter and in the spirit of the holidays, gave a donation to the Salvation Army. She then headed toward the South Parking Garage. But what happened next, she never would have expected. I had my purse on my forearm, and a, Jenna, a guy from behind just grabbed my purse, and the minute I turned, I saw, all I saw was um, a gentleman with a red long sleeve shirt, and so I just started screaming, so I, I said, help! Somebody stole my purse, or that guy stole my purse. And so I started charging after him. I started running in his direction. Manabusin had actually tripped over one of the parking blocks and fell to her knees, but quickly got back up and continued chasing after her robber. The suspect ran behind the elevator at the entrance of the garage and jumped over the wall into the hedges. It was in this very parking lot that the suspect followed the victim and grabbed her purse and quickly tried to evade the scene. Luckily, a good Samaritan stepped in and came to her rescue. U.S. Navy Master at Arms First Class Anthony McGovero was leaving the mall with his family when he heard someone screaming for help. I heard someone scream, help, and I turned around because I was pushing my son's stroller and my wife and daughter were behind me. And my wife pointed and said, he's right there, help her. There was another gentleman that ran from the opposite direction and he just ran over and he jumped over the wall as well. And he jumped, which is my good Samaritan, he, um, he jumped over the wall and he tackled that, the robber down. We ended up in the bushes and rolled across the ground and then he hopped up and took off and I was getting ready to you know, try and chase him down and they said, oh, he dropped the purse, he dropped the purse. Manabusin was able to retrieve her purse and all of its contents. She was thankful that McGovero had intervened and commended him for his bravery. I was just really happy that I could help somebody out that needed help and I was in the right place at the right time to assist her and uh, that they could have a happy holidays. The Texas-born sailor has been stationed on Guam for the past two years as a training supervisor for the U.S. Navy Security Forces. He was presented with a certificate of commendation for his actions by Senator Dennis Rodriguez Jr. on Friday at the Guam Congress Building. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Kiani Mendiola. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.